I've took the beard down a bit. It's getting a little warm and you know when you're out in the bush here it gets a bit uh, dirty. I actually uh, buzzed my head a bit too. <laughs> Not right down to the scalp but it's just more comfortable for uh, summertime when it gets hot. And you know it's nicer for washing. I mean, there's less to wash. <laughs> so, um, yeah. But yeah, I got all my gear in my backpack. My exploring gear, my uh, I don't know, my yeah, gear for uh, metal detecting and sifting. And most important thing is my coffee mug <laughs> with coffee in it of course and some snacks snacky cakes as my uh, buddy Shane would say snacky cakes I think he says that <laughs> um, then yeah I got all my I got my GPS everything finds a place I got this roped off here and then I got my emergency GPS in case I get into trouble. Nice hanger for my hat, my mood hat with uh, with uh, Snoopy. <laughs> I couldn't think there for a sec. Classic Snoopy. Starsky always goes the wrong way. He's up there. Watch. You'll you'll notice I'm going this way, and you'll sprint down in front of me. Wait for it. Oh, here he comes. See? <laughs> He's a psycho. <laughs> Just kidding. He's awesome. <clears throat> yeah, there's one here, and I think there's another one. I think on the other side of this. There's, oh yeah, it's right there. I can see it. So yeah, there's this one. And there's one buried over here too. So yeah, let's just take a look here quick. My, my battery's almost dead on my good camera, so yeah, go ahead. Oh cool, there's actually a... I think that's an old wood stove maybe? That's pretty neat. Wood stove, possibly. <laughs> it would have been cool to see this when it was standing still. I mean, you could tell they're they're not old nails. I mean, I think this this mine site was from like the 1900s, like early 1900s. So it's not super super old, but. And then there's another one I can see right here. So, we get through the bush. It's right over here. Yeah, it would have been nice to see these things standing. But time or human interruption. Taking them out, one or the other. <laughs> Ow! It's a prickle. I can see in there. Just a tripod I can stretch out so I can kind of get you a little further in. And I can get in. Or two. It's been cool to see these standing, but still cool to see them as they are now. <laughs> <laughs> the old shingles.
been working on uh, cleaning up this old cabin site. I'm just uh, doing the inside right now, just cleaning all the down wood out of there. <laughs> on this little little bucket. And then uh, some parts of the stove here. A bigger bucket that's rusted out and then I'm just piling a bunch of wood right here cleaning the site up. I did a bit of sifting. You can see I sifted this area. I haven't found anything really interesting yet. Just a bunch of nails and a bit of glass and stuff but I think this is the front door so I did a bit of sifting here but I think the original ground is probably lower down underneath all the overburden here so I might try sifting through some of that later but I'm just uh, working the inside right now trying to clean that out a bit. Give her a swing with the metal detector and see if there's uh, any good targets exposed now. big uh, bucket pan thing and then you got the ripples you know like getting your shirt on and then washing your clothes and <laughs> that's pretty cool An old pot. <laughs> huh. That's actually like you know when you have the cover for the old stoves, I think you put that over top of it, I think. Maybe. An old uh, cast iron plate, metal plate. Little shovels are really good too. You can pack it with your uh, bag. It's I uh, can't remember the company. Eagle. Uh, is this area? Oh, Predator Tools. That's right. 
predator tool. It's a little, uh, what is it, 18 inch shovel or something. It's got little grooves on it too to cut through roots. <laughs> Great purchase. Compact and very useful for this stuff. seems to be big. Oh, no, looks like another plate. Or a little pot, I can't tell. There, there we go. It's a little, little bowl of some sort. I don't see any writing on it, but obviously it's gonna be probably the same company as that plate. Just throw it aside for now. There's things in here. Put the work in and you find stuff. Sounds like there's probably more plate or kitchenware down there. One may or glass, so easy to break, so Let's see UD company, whatever that means. It's an older cork style top bottle. Um, UD company. It's a slick on the front and back, but that's neat. Oh, here's a big bowl or something right here. So there's lots of targets in here. Then uh, yeah, look at that. It's a big pot. Water in it. Wow, it's still uh, that's still usable. I could probably actually use this to haul some dirt out because <laughs> I don't have a bucket. That's, that's nice. Wow, surprised that lasted in the ground like that. I think there's more down there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Getting the whole set. It's a tiny little plate. set of kitchenware. <laughs> Old saw. Old saw handle, I guess you could say. It's fall apart now. You can actually wrap a piece of wire around it to keep it together, but See where it's all split. That's the front 
lid side there. <laughs> 